morning. Um, I love Good Morning Slow. I don't know if there's any event where you have like 18 speakers in a row, but it actually is interesting and compelling, and the energy of the crowd here is just so contagious. So reflect on our awesome community, and we're so excited to tell you today about our new downtown facility. So for those of you who don't know me, Karen Tillman, uh, as I mentioned, I am the Interim Executive Director for the Center of Innovation and Entrepreneurship. That is my second job. My first job is I am the Economic Development Advisor to President Armstrong for Cal Poly. And um, one of the things that I wanted to do is give you a little bit of information about the CIE, Center for Innovation and Entrepreneurship, if you're not familiar, and then talk to you a bit more about what we're actually doing downtown. So, the Center for Innovation and Entrepreneurship has been something that's been in existence since about 2010, Cal Poly. And the program was really built initially to support both students and community members who are looking to really explore the ideas of entrepreneurship and innovation. And there's two components, two main points of this, um, of this program. First is what we do on campus. We have an amazing set of co-curricular and academic opportunities that really help our students decide, hey, I have an idea. Is this something that I would want to do? What do I do with it? And they can do things like join the hatchery, which is our on-campus incubator. We have multiple different kinds of pitch competitions. We have an extraordinarily faculty, an extraordinarily positive faculty fellow program, which is run by uh, Kim Bishop is one of our faculty fellows, which is my favorite, so thank you, Kim, you're always doing this. <laughs> And so it's a fantastic experience, and it's really fun because we get to be with these students. We're in their really, really, really messy part of figuring out if they want to form a company. I have to say, it is truly one of the most special things I've experienced in my career. The second part of what we do at the CIE is really our community program. And as Jim mentioned, we currently have a hot house downtown. We've been there, I think, since 2010. Um, above the old Ross building, you probably will miss it unless you look up and see a very small great Cal Poly Center for Innovation Entrepreneurship sign. Um, and one of the things that we really wanted to do is we've been running this program for some time, but we really wanted to double down on our investment, both in the community engagement aspect as well as the economic development aspect. So as Jim mentioned, we're moving, we are assuming the lease at 1144 Choro, which is a building that has been open for 15 years. Some of you know it as the old Copeland's building across from Shoe Palace on one side and to have it on the other. So it's a giant space that we're going to be renovating for a year. It will house both the Center for Innovation and Entrepreneurship, the Mustang Shop, which currently resides on Hygiera Street in downtown San Luis Obispo. But the thing that I'm really excited to talk to you about today is this is something that we want to co-create with all of you in the community. Yes, Cal Poly will be the host facility, but we really see this as an opportunity to bring together innovators, entrepreneurs, economic development partners. Um, we have such a fantastic community of people that really support this effort. Our partner with the Chamber and the Downtown Association, the city and the county who have been part of us at the beginning, our amazing friends at Reach who really help us conceptualize a lot of the things we want to do from an economic development perspective. So we want to take this and not just say, hey, we're going to pick up the building that we have on here and just basically walk it down to Toro Street. We want to say, what do we want to do? How do we reimagine the space? Um, and we want to include all of you. So over the next year, we're, we are holding a bunch of different engagements to really understand what does the community want? What are the opportunities that we have ahead of us? So hopefully I'll be back in another couple of months to tell you more about how to engage. But I wanted to let you know that Cal Poly is really, really committed to the work we do in innovation, entrepreneurship, and economic development. And this building, while they have the Cal Poly name on it, is really for all of us. So we're looking forward to co-creating it with you. Thank you.